Hello and welcome. This is James Blanchard Cisneros at your service. Today I will be reading the August 23rd post and making a couple comments on it, and I trust it will assist both of us on our journey. Here we go. Today, who we see is whom we serve. We fail at nothing when we acknowledge that he, she, source who sent us goes with us on our appointed journey. We know this because it is not by chance that out of 7 billion people, this specific person has been placed in front of us. The people we meet today are those we have been appointed to serve. They have been entrusted to us by God's source to help lead us back to the state of peace and joy. Today we do not look upon their bodies and judge some momentary event in time. Today we look past that and through to their perfect eternal nature. They have asked for help in remembering their truth, and today we are their answer. The light in our words and actions will shine on them to help them see and remember who they truly are. Today our acknowledgement of, our, of the truth in them will strengthen our own. Randomness, coincidence, accidents, all fairy tales of the ego made to try to explain something it could not. Today, let us remember that it's not, it is not by accidents or coincidence that our brother and sister out of seven billion people is in front of us today. They have through their thoughts and prayers asked for help and assistance and we are part of that answer and we have asked to be of service and they are part of that answer they are part of our mission it does not need to be some monumental uh, act. It could be a kind smile. You could sit with a brother and sister, just listen to them non-judgmentally. You could say a kind word or two to them to lift them up. Any kindness is part of our mission because that is simply part of who we truly are. Any love, any kindness, any generosity, God's source has in, 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 excuse me. God's source has entrusted his child to us. Would you trust your child with someone you had no confidence in? Someone you did not trust in? And so let us remember that God's source is entrusting us with his child today. That child, that brother or sister that is in front of us, God has entrusted us with. And we are worthy of that trust. And so today, let us not judge a brother or sister through some by some momentary event or action or words that they said or did today that is not their truth their truth is eternal and changeless it is compassionate it is forgiving it is loving that is their truth and will always be their truth and when we see that in them we remember it in ourselves and so the great gift that they offer us as we offer them. We are of service to them as they are to us. And so let us offer gratitude. Thank you very much for joining me today. 
If you will, please like or comment on the video and assist with the listing process. I love you very much. Um, also, if you have any questions, I would love to try and respond to them. And uh, God willing, we will see each other tomorrow. Peace.